Top story, several cats were killed in a fire that tore through a strip mall in Culver City early this morning. The flames destroyed several stores, including a cat boarding facility. KTLA 5's Rachel Menatoff joins us live in Culver City, where firefighters were able to rescue some of the cats. What happened, Rachel? Courtney and Carlos, sadly, 17 cats were killed when a major fire tore through this shopping center. And you can see here behind us the extent of the damage. Right now, firefighters are clearing out a lot of the debris. They're also conducting an investigation into what happened. They've been out here now for close to 12 hours. There are seven businesses here impacted by both the smoke and fire damage, and one of them is, of course, the pet boarding facility, which you mentioned. This happened on West Venice Boulevard around 545 this morning. We also know that one firefighter was injured by the intense heat and was taken to the hospital for observation. The direct fire damage was limited to five adjoining businesses here, a nail salon, a smoke shop, a martial arts studio and also the pet hotel. A jewelry store and a restaurant were also damaged. All seven of these businesses are under the same roof and the cause of the fire is still under investigation. Tragically, 17 cats perished in this fire. We believe there's two that did survive. Those numbers are still um, inaccurate because we don't know what the outcome is gonna be, the final outcome. But this is very tragic for a lot of home, uh, pet owners who've uh, entrusted their animals to, to be here. And uh, we are going to treat this very seriously with a full investigation to find out what the cause is. And there were several cats that thankfully did survive this fire. They are now being housed at another pet facility called Cat Place LA, also on Venice Boulevard. And if you are driving in this area on Venice Boulevard between Culver and Robertson, keep in mind that there is one lane westbound open as firefighters out here continue their investigation into what caused this massive fire. We're live in Culver City. I'm Rachel Menatoff, KTLA 5 News.